Hello everybody, this is Greek Myth Guy here for another episode of the SMP series, the second episode. And today is going to be a pretty cool episode. We got some stuff to do. Last time we pretty much just did the mining and I didn't want to do that again in the episode. So I went ahead and got all this stuff here. So we're definitely really good to go on that. So I haven't actually really I haven't done anything big. I haven't made anything with any of the with any of the ores I got, except I think I made the armor actually in the episode, so I haven't actually done anything with it. And so this episode, we are just going to go ahead and work on doing that. Let me go ahead and throw out these fireworks that we are messing around with. Don't really need this stuff. Um, and let's go ahead. So I think the first thing we probably should do is make a diamond pickaxe, and then we can go ahead down to. Um, go down pretty deep and see if we can get some obsidian and that should be really nice because we're about to get a portal up and uh, some other stuff too let's go ahead and make that and then i think i have some food in the furnace and then we can uh ah, come on. then we can go ahead down and maybe even i think we might be able to get uh, another portal up today which would be pretty nice i think one of the other players maybe two of them have gotten portals up and I haven't actually done that yet, so I'm a little bit behind, but um, it's all good. I just wanted to do it in the episode. So let's see what we have in here. Got some more iron. Um, oh, we gotta have food somewhere. I don't have any food. Um, we got one piece that needs to be cooked down. Let's just go ahead and eat that. I mean, why not? Oh, we also had, got a potato off killing a zombie. So now we can uh, make a farm start working on that. Alright, let's go ahead and go down to the bottom of the world, make sure my video setting is on bright, which it's not. Now it's on bright, so we'll see a lot better. I don't know, I think I'm getting like a little bit of lag, I'm not exactly sure why. Hold on just a second. Uh... Alright. Oh, it's because there's a scheduled hardware scan going on, and uh, it doesn't want to close. Let's see if I can close the program. Yep, okay, it's closed. Maybe, yeah, look at that, we went up 15 frames. That's pretty nice. Um, I don't even know why that started. Yo, that, that's a lot better. Alright, so let's go ahead all the way down to the bottom and grab some of that really nice obsidian. So we need four for the table, and then we need ten for the portal. Alright, um, I didn't bring a water bucket with me. That was a bad idea. Uh, let me go flash home real quick. Grab a water bucket. Then do slash back. And we can go ahead and grab some iron out of here. We only need three of those. That will also take them out. We'll enable it to smelt faster. You know what? And I'm getting lag again. I think it was just that was up here. And maybe it's the furnace? The furnace is going? No, I mean, that doesn't make any sense. I mean, I'm why am I lagging again? Like, now I'm down below 30 frames. That's just weird. And if I get, if I go back, let's see, if I go back down, if I go back down here, is it going to get, go up again? Yeah, like, okay, that's weird, because it doesn't have to generate very much, or maybe there's, like, some kind of mobs around there that I'm not seeing. I know I have, like, ten chickens, I'll show you that in a bit, towards the end of the episode, probably. I started a chicken farm, and once that gets big, it'll be really good for all the arrows and everything, and also just to sell to the shop and get some money when we get that plugin set up. Um, okay, yo, looks like this is going to be a pretty easy mission. We've got some of that up to the now we'll just go ahead... And let's not mine that block, because there's probably, yep, there we go, there was, there was some of it. Alright, now, where can we do this and not, like, waste obsidian? Right here. Alright, put that in there, and then we'll just go ahead, hop into this hole, and then just mine the tin, so I'll speed this up, and I'll be right back with you. Yeah, you know what? Not gonna speed up, so I don't want to have to edit this. It's gonna be really long, so I guess I'll just do a bit of a story time while we're in here. Check about uh, random life stuff. Let's see what I tell you. Um, if you're from my vlog channel, which should be in the uh, in my description, if you haven't seen it, or if you have, I think at one point I said I was going to do a vlog about 
going to Canada, which I never actually did because I've been really busy and haven't been putting on a vlog. So what if I go ahead and do that right now? Because it sounds really good. So as you know, if you've been on my vlog channel for a while, I made a video called Canada Pain, which was one of my first videos where I talked about this big trip I had up to Canada and how I ended up like cutting my finger open with a knife at camp and like ruining myself and getting stitches and having surgery and all that stuff. Not any fun. Um, Oh, it's when you don't want to be black. I'm blacking I'm at 45 frames. That's weird. Uh, slash ping. Pong. Okay, so it's good. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Anyhow, so I went back up to Canada a second time. This year was the second time up. And this year we were looking at like a lot more competition because last year we did win. Basically, first place. There was no first place ribbon. But we won more ribbon than any of the other patrols. Given out for uh, like a uh, like a 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 there's ribbon giving out for like a cooking competition. There's ribbon giving out for like the best, the wide games, like the games and stuff. And so we won the majority of those last year. We won a very big majority, but it was just our troop and one of the troop that was there. But this year when we went, there's actually like a, like I think five groups there, five troops. So we had like a lot more competition and it was like a lot of fun. I was go ahead and say the spoiler, which is yes, once again we did win. We did win. This year wasn't just like winning most ribbons. We there was an overall first place ribbon, and we did win that one as well. The so Blue Jay Patrol is the best patrol. We all know that. Anyhow, I'm back to the story. There, we did like a lot of fun things this year. I didn't actually cut myself at all, though I didn't get sick. Nothing went wrong until the day I got home, which is when I got sick. Which obviously didn't matter since I was just going to be chilling for like a week or two anyway. But yeah, we had a lot of fun. One of the best things we did was we did this uh, cooking competition. I just mentioned we did that last year. We didn't win when it was a big fiasco. I said so in the vlog, but we ended up uh, burning down our cooking table and a bunch of other stuff. And it wasn't good. We tried cooking with oil and all on fire. But this year, what we did we cooked Mexican food. And so we had like taco salad and like a lot of other stuff. And we won first place in that one. It was a lot of fun. What we did was we set up like an RV. And we had people acting out the different restaurant positions. I was like the manager, so I would greet people when they came in and do all that kind of jazz. And then we had our head cook, and we had this kid who was really funny making like the jokes and stuff in the back. And that was pretty cool. So we cooked up our Mexican food, and all the leaders thought we were hysterical, and they, we impressed them. And lo and behold, we ended up getting the first place. But I don't think, our, personally, personally, I don't think that our food was the best food. Because this other patrol, which like always wins it, and they were really expecting to win, and now they're really impressed that they didn't win. But their cooking was really good. And um, yeah, the, it was judged like 50% cooking, 50% presentation. And um, unfortunately, they didn't have full scale three course dinner restaurant set up with greeting and with a waiting area and with a nice table and table decorations and a gift shop which we just happened to randomly have so we were the ones that won that and that was amazing look at that enchant table now we're done talking and we can go ahead and make oh, we need one piece of and one piece of steel and then we're not steel with all the iron and we can go ahead and get into the nether because we got just enough supplies to do that and yep all right uh, i'm not gonna do splash craft it's a boost. I don't think I actually gave that command to anybody, so I should probably give that to the players. And plus, I just have a crafting table right here anyway. All right, let's go ahead and make a nice little another portal. We're going to go one, two here, put a cobble, put a cobble, and yeah, I'm not getting lag up here now. Okay, it's kind of weird. All right, let's do that. Do this. Can I build here? Nah. You know what I was thinking? the other day was that reach hacking would be really nice for SMP series. I'm not going to use it. But like I don't well, actually I don't even know how it works. It might not work that way. But if it would enable you and not just for SMP series, like 
if you're building anything, it would be amazing because you could just like stand like say here. Okay, this is kind of it's good. Like say if I was building like a wall and I had like a really far reach pack, I could be right here and just say build all the way up. That would be like amazing. Battery tool that goes. All right, and let's go ahead into the Nether. Hopefully, it doesn't pop into lava. That would be really sad. I don't want to get my first F of this series. No, oh, but I have portal. Okay, dude, what is this? Is this like? Did somebody build this? Whoa. Um. What did I just spawn into? Interesting. Um. Did I like smash it? I don't think that's probably a bad idea. I think it actually might be Master Mickey's. I'll go watch this video in a second. And, um, see if it is when I finish doing this. Go watch, um, is there anything up here? It looks like... You know what, see, it looks like there's something else up there. I don't know if that's just a roof. Yeah, it might just be a roof, but there might be something, like, up above that. Alright, anyhow. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter, but we'll just go ahead and start heading in the direction. If we can find anything that we need, like aka nether fortresses and stuff like that, because if we can find another fortress, then we can go ahead and start getting potions. And of course, the big thing that you want to be the one to do is get in, and we're going to need some blaze powder for that. And I don't know, if, I might be able to get set up to where we can have multiple ends, so once somebody completes it, then we can have other people get a chance to go in there. And do the end as well, but I really I am looking forward to doing that. I want to go fight the Ender Dragon because actually I was playing um, a single player world. I was playing like a super flat thing and just because I didn't have an internet connection and I was like doing some builds and I decided to spawn the Ender Dragon. And I figured out that if you, as long it, if you don't have armor on, basically it takes two hits to kill you, but it is very possible to kill it with nothing but. Uh, unenchanted except for infinity bow and a wooden sword and I did like three times without dying so I almost want to just do that like as a challenge in a video it's the end and then just like go for the cinder dragon no armor the probably the only the only problem would be like the enderman because I was doing it like just in a overworld without any enderman that would attack me but as long as I don't look at them then we'll be good alright let's see what's down here we got some of this block some of this there uh, Nether quartz stuff. I don't really need it. Uh, we got a bunch of netherrack. Don't really need that. Got a ton of lava. I'm scared of that. We got some glowstone. That is one of the things I definitely want. And of course, what we want is another fortress, and we're just going to keep looking around, hoping we see one of those, but I kind of doubt it. And honestly, I seem to be lagging like a little bit. I don't know if I'm lagging in the recording or not. I don't know if it looks like I'm lagging, but I just feel lag. I don't know why. It, it just it just doesn't feel like it's moving right. Let us say that. All right, there's some glowstone. We got one of these guys here. Um, I would really like to attack them, but I don't feel confident in fighting right now when I don't feel I can control it. So let's just go up here and get some glowstone, and then probably since we're at 13 minutes into the video, head back into the overworld because yes, the first video was really long, like 38 minutes. But the rest of them are going to be all be like 15 minutes or less, unless we're doing like a challenge mining video. Because you know what? I don't want to make really long videos. I mean, I'm, I'll probably be playing for a bit longer on here. But it's probably not going to be fun to watch me run around for eternity. I don't know if you feel differently, then let me know in the comment section. But you know what? I think we should have something that we do for each episode. This episode was getting over to the nether. Get in that enchant table, and next episode will be something else. And so, once we do that, then we go ahead home if I can figure out which direction that was. Um, mm, this could be problematic. I don't know why I'm talking in an accent, it doesn't really matter. It's kind of funny, actually, because I'm going to freak out if I can't get home because I have actually, I don't have anything good on me. What if I just kill myself? Okay, well, yes. It doesn't really matter since I didn't find another portal. So, let's see. You know what we're going to do? We are going to play a game. And it's called... Um, what should we call this? Not exactly sure. Uh, let's call this F5 mode. Running around in... Uh, oops. Never mind. I was going to jump in the lava and be really funny, but... Oh, 
Rip, keep your inventories on. I was going to lose everything, but, ah, uh, that's a problem. I might have to get rid of this so it's not loose. Anyhow, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Thanks so much for watching. Have a wonderful, great day. It's been Greek Myth Guy, and peace out.